uh, Robert Sapolsky uh, at, at Stanford, he, he says that animals, he wrote a, a great book many years ago uh, called Why Zebras Don't Get Ulcers. And it was Han Selle, the, the originator of the whole concept of stress and the difference between short-term and long-term, who, who described ulcers as being a classic example of the result of prolonged stress. Zapolsky says, we don't get, um, the, or animals don't have these sustained, uh, I'm sure we can evoke it in them, but in general, in the wild, he says, either you get away or you're somebody's meal. And so that response is something that we use as an animal that we use maybe two or three times in our life. And usually when the older we get or the younger we are, the response is not successful. So just saying, you, we, really, it's, it's once or twice we use it and, and we get away or we don't get away. That's not what happens for us. We grow, we're in a very, very different environment. It, mind you, we're in a different environment, but we have basically the same physiology to which you could make the case we are ill-fitted. We are ill, or there's probably, in those places where we are ill-fitted, there's a likelihood of problems, right? So I think something like awareness through movement, the Feldenkrais method, and I would add meditation, and I would add maybe vigorous exercise, all of these things are able to interrupt the physical hormonal effects of prolonged stress or sustained anxiety. Um, so um, back to there being a real physical pathway that's happening that's common to all of us which is that we are pulled down. Our, the muscles of the front of our cells contract very strongly. This is a life-threatening situation in theory. Uh, we, we are pulled down, our chest contracts, our abdomen contracts, our, the flexors of our neck contract, so our head is pulled forward protecting our organs, protecting ourselves, and ready to decide, am I going to go forward? Am I going to go backwards? Am I going to go right? Am I going to go left? Which are all life-preserving decisions that I, that I is not mediated the level of thought. Everything is happening very, very quickly. So that's great. Because if you're the zebra, you, you do it, and, and then you decide, am I fighting? Am I running? and you're off. <laughs>